Hi friends, in this video, I am going to deal about one of the common malpresentation that is face presentation. Here the face is the presenting part which comes in relation with the internal O's. Here in the case of face presentation, the denominator is mentum and the different positions are right mentor posterior, left mentor posterior, right mentor lateral, left mentor lateral, right mentor anterior and left mentor anterior. See the denominator is mentum and if the mentum is pointing towards the right sacroiliac joint, right sacroiliac joint, if the baby is like this, this position is right mentor posterior and if the mentum is pointing towards the left sacroiliac joint, left sacroiliac joint, see this is left mentor posterior. If the mentum is pointing towards the left iliopectineal line, left iliopectineal line, this position is left mentolateral. If the mentum is pointing towards the right iliopectineal line, this is right mentolateral. If the mentum is pointing towards the right iliopectineal eminence, right iliopectineal eminence, the position is right mento anterior and the engaging diameter enter into the left oblique diameter of the pelvis. And if the mentum is pointing towards the left iliopectineal eminence, see the mentum is pointing towards the left iliopectineal eminence and the engaging diameter that is submentobrachmatic enter in the right oblique diameter of the pelvis. Now we can see the definition of mechanism. As the fetus descends, the soft tissues and bony structures exert pressure which force it to negotiate the birth canal through a series of passive movements and these movements are collectively known as the mechanism of labor. Next is the principles of mechanism. First one, descent takes place throughout the labor. Second one, whichever part comes and meets the resistance of the pelvic floor will rotate forward until it comes under the symphysis pubis. Third one, whichever part emerges out of the pub symphysis pubis will pivot around the pubic bone. Here in the case of now we are going to see the mechanism of LMA, left mento anterior. In the case of LMA, the lie is longitudinal, attitude is extension of the head and flexion of the body, presentation is cephalic presentation, position is left mento anterior, denominator is mentum and the presenting part is face. Now we can see the cardinal movements. First one is engagement. See, it is entering in the, the head is getting engaged uh, with the submentobrachmatic 9.5 centimeter in the right oblique diameter of the brim and the occiput will be pointing towards the ilio, uh, sacroiliac joint, right sacroiliac joint and the mentum will be pointing towards the left iliopectineal eminence and next is descent, descent takes place throughout the labor and finally it ends with the delivery of the baby and next is extension, when it is descending it will start to meet the resistance of the pelvic flow and uh, with increasing extension the mentum becomes the leading part. Next is internal rotation, when it is meeting the resistance of the pelvic flow this will rotate forward, the phase mentum will rotate 1 by 8th of the circle and it comes under the symphysis pubis. This will rotate 1 by 8th of the circle and it come it will come under the symphysis pubis. Now the chin is under the symphysis pubis you see and next is delivery of the head. The chin sweeps the subpubic arch and the face, sinciput and occiput will deliver by extension. And next is the restitution, the twist that has occurred during the internal rotation will be corrected by a slight untwisting movement that is restitu restitution. Next is internal rotation of the head, sorry internal rotation of the shoulder. The shoulder is entering in the left oblique diameter of the pelvis and this will rotate 1 by 8th of the circle and it will come under the symphysis pubis. At the same time, you can see the head, external rotation of the head also will occur. 
see this shoulder rotate 1 by 8th of the circle and it comes under the symphysis pubis now it is under the symphysis pubis at the same time external rotation of the head also has occurred now the delivery of the shoulder the anterior shoulder sweeps the subpubic arch and the posterior shoulder escape under the under the perineum and the body is borne by lateral flexion towards mother's abdomen so that's all about the mechanism of labor in the case of left mento anterior position thank you for watching this video thank you